and don't panic about Mercury retrograde. Hello Libra. Well, North Node in the first house still. And it's, you know, how North Node, South Node, they're always moving backwards through signs. So if you're, say, a Libra born in September, the North Node activation is pretty strong right now. So there's this desire to have shortcuts. There's this desire to get there quicker, to somehow have harmony quicker. We can't quicken harmony. We don't know why we feel competitive in relationships, but that's our south node in Aries that activates our relationships, and that's what we're feeling right now. Venus and Cancer, up in the midheaven. Good time to show your best work. Good time to show your best talents and skills. But you really have something going on that people are looking for that's beautiful, and people are relying on you. Now, Mars and Mercury in the ninth house, I mean, you want to wander. There's this wanderlust. I want to take a vacation. I, I'm going to learn something from it. It's going to be exciting. You know, Mars is excitement. And Mercury is learning and information. And higher knowledge is in the ninth house. You put all these things together, something good could happen. But I want to caution you. A lot of times there's danger in travel when you're in the ninth house. So if you're, it means like you're climbing Mount Shasta. I mean, just... That's a good Mars-like activity that's exotic as far as an experience go. I mean, that's, that's good, but just use caution. Um, <clears throat> Jupiter and Leo, you have a good social life, good network of friends, people around you. Um, I think you're going to do, do good this week.